Welcome Smackers, Kevin Smack here. Today I want to show you how the pros are so good at aiming. And I yes, 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 it is because of practice and playing a whole lot, but there is a setting in Fortnite you need to change that they don't allow you to change. So I'm going to show you how to change that to make things a little better. Basically what you want to do is go into the file explorer. We'll go ahead and open that. And then we're going to search in the quick search. It is gameusersetting.ini. So we're going to go ahead and search for that under the C drive. Make sure you select the C drive first. And then we'll search for that. Um, what this setting does is basically there is something in Fortnite that speeds up your mouse, an accelerator, and it makes it so you can't always know exactly how to move the mouse every time. So for example, if I move it an inch, it might go a little bit more because it's got the acceleration on. So what this setting does is it makes it so it is hard coded. So if you need to do a 360, you know exactly how far to move your hand on the mouse pad on the mouse to go ahead and get that uh, acceleration uh, without the extra boost kicked in. So I'm gonna have some other stuff here because I did play uh, Ark and it looks like Ark has it as well. So we're just looking for the Fortnite copy. Should come up any moment here. It's going a little slower than usual. Um, you can also go to the path, the up at the path right here so you can see it if you just wanna go, there you go. And come on, come on, finish searching. There we go. There we go. So we're looking for uh, Epic Games. Fortnite, here it is. Okay, so it's this one. Um, app data, local data, Fortnite saved. We're gonna go ahead and um, open the file location. So that goes to that folder automatically. And here is the file, the gamer user setting.ini. So you can double click on it. Once you do, it'll open it. So here is the uh, item here. It's actually right towards the top. It's only a few down. Um, it'll say B disabled mouse acceleration equals false. So what you want to do is turn that on so it is disabled. So you just go ahead and do true. Once you do true, you do file save. Um, you can go ahead and just save it on top of itself. It's not gonna save for me because I have it set up so it can't save. I'll explain that in a second. Um, so you just go ahead and choose save and then you close out of it. So mine is already set to true. Uh, if I go back in here, you can see it's already set to true. Uh, what I did was I right clicked on it after I was done and went to properties and it chose read only. This makes it so Fortnite can't change it back. So it is always set up there. No, you cannot get banned for this. This is just an option that is not available in the GUI. A lot of the high up players are using it because it makes life so much easier and it makes it muscle memory just works a lot better. So that is what they do. Uh, I hope this helped you. If it did, please leave a like, give it a try, give it a few games because it does take a while. For me, I noticed an improvement pretty much right away with the first game or so is a little weird. It's not that much of a difference at first, but when you're moving your mouse a whole lot, then you start noticing it more, that, um, how it works smoother for you. So let me know how it works for you guys. I hope this video helped. And if you like these kind of videos, let me know. We'll keep them coming. Other ways to improve your aiming just real quick would be uh, upgrade your monitor. Monitors have refresh rates. A lot of the standard monitors are 60 hertz. You want to get around, you know, uh, 120 to 240 um, hertz refresh rate on the monitor if you are looking for competitive gameplay. Um, also, you're going to need a computer that can do more than 60 frames um, per second. So you're probably going to try to shoot for whatever number you get with the hertz, uh, even though they're not directly correlated. Um, hopefully that makes sense for you. Um, so that's one another way to become better at aiming. And another way is practice. Keep playing, play, play, play. The more you play, the better you'll get. Guys, thank you so much for checking out this tutorial. And as always, smack out.